Hey guys, what's going on? Welcome to Critical Guides. Uh, we're starting off here with our first gameplay video, Tom Clancy's Division, the day it came out. I'm not sure when this video will be out exactly, but we're going to go ahead and kick off this new channel um, with a new game. <laughs> That's the best way to do it. I'm also here with my sister. She won't be playing, but she will be talking a little bit. Um, she's sitting kind of far away, so we're not exactly sure how well you guys will be able to hear her. But without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. So, uh, after customizing my character, who's this old guy? Oh my... Okay, we're back at it here. Uh, after custom customizing my character, um, I went ahead with the the douchebag faded look, the aviator glasses, and a neck tattoo because uh, there wasn't too much options to customize, to be honest with you. But uh, let's go ahead and try something out. So I'm not even sure what I was supposed to do. I kind of played for a few minutes here and then got here, and I was like, you know what? I'm gonna decide to record this, and uh, I just went for it. So we got a bunch of idiots running around in here. Um, half of them are doing jumping jacks because they're all getting ready to exercise. So I figured, why not join them and. Uh, yeah. So let's verify identity, whatever this means. Identity confirmed. SHD equipment activated. Okay. Hey, what you need? So I guess we're uh okay, wrong way. I'm gonna talk to this guy. Thank God you're here, Agent. I've never seen Brooklyn like this. We're barely hanging on. I'll be your point of contact for any emergency ops. We've had plenty of action and it's not letting up. So I'm not really sure how personal to get with you guys, but uh, I'm not gonna have you know, for my uh, subscribers from Wizard101, you guys know I talk to a really personal level when I do like gameplay videos and stuff. So uh, since this is my first video, I'm not going to go into too much detail about myself, but I guess I can talk to you guys a little bit while I play. And uh, that would be pretty freaking awesome, huh? Where do I go now, Elise? We're gonna restart the Okay, never mind, I know where to go. Warning. Now leaving the safe area. Isaac can intercept Jeez. transmissions from locations on the map. So you can get a little more intel on what you're getting into. Okay, so it's kind of Agent. like the uh the, the beta, but not really because it starts off way differently. They try and sell it back to all the starving people. Plain and simple profiteering on the backs of people who are suffering. Get that food back. Okay. Huh? So apparently I gotta get some food back from this guy. Oh, who's this able? Put him down. It looks like they nerfed the the power of these guys a little bit, which is pretty good. Alright, so this guy was dead. Missing supply crate located. So if you guys don't know who I am. Uh, my name is Landon, I am from Wizard101 Guides, and that is my first channel. I have grown it to a beautiful place right now, and you guys, uh, have, uh, seen it, and I think it's a really good thing for me to kind of, uh, branch out, and that's why I made the second channel, so I can do everything that I couldn't do on Wizard101 Guides. So for that reason, um, we're here playing The Division. <laughs> Alright, at least go for it. Bring it in and talk. Got a microphone right here waiting for you, kiddo. <clears throat> yep. Oh. Come on, you gotta talk a little bit. So if you guys don't know much about us, uh, we are gamers slash vloggers, and we... Oh gosh, I have to put these guys down. Hold up. Okay, got him. So, we're gamers slash vloggers, and on our first channel, we uploaded everything, and, you know, sometimes people would get mad when it wasn't Wizard101 related. And that was, that's okay, you know, we did tech videos, unboxings, other games, vlogs, and they just really didn't appreciate it. So, we decided to make a second channel for those of you who actually do appreciate those kinds of things. And basically, what makes us unique is that it's not just one person that owns the YouTube channel, it's actually two of us, my sister and I. And we're not not you to YouTube exactly. I mean, we're solid seven months old. I guess you could call that new in a way, but it's not like we're rookies. Just because our channel is new and everything doesn't mean we are new. So we know what it's like. We've been to the other side. <laughs> We've seen it all. Okay, we're back at it again. Hopefully, no more interruptions. My mom actually yelled at me to go move her car. So let's hit this up again. 
So my name is Landon. My sister's name is Elise. If you guys are from Wizard One, you know you would know me as Blake. And the reason why I went by Blake for so long is I love the name, and it was my character's name. And I felt like, oh, it was cool the for you guys to always call me Blake because it's a Wizard One channel. But then I felt like with my new channel, I should just come out and say my real name. Uh, you guys, apparently, some of you already knew my sister's name. I don't know. We haven't really, like, made a complete reveal about that. And a lot of you guys just assume my name is Blake, and I guess that's completely okay. Um, you know, I don't mind if you want to call me that still, but that is okay either way. Okay, so now you have different missions to go to. Side mission, side mission. And here's the safe house. Probably gonna try and sell it or use it. We've got people in real pain who need those drugs. You were around. See if you can recover that crate. Throw them out. There looks to be some sort of weird glitch here. Um, you notice I like shoot and it won't make a noise. That's kind of the the first weird thing I've noticed so far. So uh, I won't be worried about that too much. But you know, eventually I can see how it's kind of annoying. Maybe it won't even show up on the game audio. But right now it's weird because I can't hear the bullets. What? Gotta draw him out of cover. You're all more done. We own this place. Oh, we're done. Crap. We can take what are we trying to do? Confirmed. Sparrow 5 is on site and ready to engage. Is secure. No more hostiles detected. You're damn good in the Great fight. work, Agent. We'll get those drugs back to the wounded where they'll be used properly. Alright, so we're able to collect a few things here, and uh, now I'm gonna go ahead and switch headphones after that tense situation. Oh, there we go. Now I can hear it. Sweet. Okay, so now we're going to be selecting the next mission. Um, you're just kind of doing side missions to kind of get you started, and then you can head back to the safe house. And, yeah. Situation at a bank. Looks like you'll have to go through the subway tunnel to access the building. We need you to move in and minimize the damage. So having a gaming PC, a PS4, and an Xbox One, I have the ability. What's this guy doing, messing? Yeah, I have the ability to be playing this game on basically any console slash PC you could think of, but, uh, you know, my friends all have Xbox One, so it's kind of where I had to get it. Unfortunately, they don't have the game yet, but they will be getting it very soon, so I'm solo riding to let die. Taking the old abandoned subway. And what's really cool about this game is it's not post apocalyptic and it's not pre apocalyptic. It's like in the middle of apocalyptic. It's like during the crisis. And I actually find that to be really cool. Whether you could be the, the savior or not. Why am I in here? <laughs> oh gosh. Maybe that was the right way. Oh yeah, here we go. Ha! Huh. So hopefully I can make some more gameplay of this game and just, you know, myself playing with my friends and all that good good. Alright, so we got this hoodlum over here. He doesn't uh, know exactly where I'm at. The way I kind of feel like this game, I kind of feel like it's um, a modern day Assassin's Creed in some ways. Mixed with a little bit of Destiny, but uh, the thing about Destiny, it wasn't completely open world like this is. Assassin's Creed has an open world like this, you can go up, you can use tactics, or you can use blunt force, whatever you want to use. Either one is cool in this game. Got him. Alright, we're moving in hot. Just wait until my buddies get this game, it's going to be a lot more cool, and we can all like have our own little base set up and infiltrate things secretly together. Maybe get some Rainbow Six Siege kind of stuff going on. Nice work shutting that down, Agent. Finally! Oh, thank you so, so much. Grateful. That was terrifying. 
no, it's I okay, guys. No, oh, it's okay. It's completely okay. I don't know why you're wearing pimp clothes. I don't know who you think you are, but uh, we'll get through this, all right? There's only two of you guys locked in there against one little door. I'm pretty sure you could have could have handled that, okay? All right, now we're gonna roll back to the safe house. Always a good sign, though, right? No, it usually means there's an upgrade or something going on. And this part right here reminds me of Dying Light, having to hop over a bunch of obstacles to get into a safe area. What do they call them? Safe zones or whatever? Oh my gosh, how do I get stuck up here? That really hurt me that much? Jesus. <laughs> oh god, what are you doing in this room? Oh, you guys are gonna burn a cop car and use it as a fire. Like, whoa. <laughs> we got in your guys' head, and then there's like an ambulance right here, a big fire truck. You guys could all be using this for supplies. You're crazy. You know what I mean? And one of the benefits to this game, also, by the way, is. Like I said, it's not post apocalyptic, so there's no like zombies running around, so I feel like that would kind of ruin it. This place, you can actually still see like living people, you know, normal people trying to live their daily lives through this outbreak. And uh, if you don't know anything about the division at all, basically on Black Friday, somebody put, um, you know, like uh, a disease or something on a couple dollar bills, and that got spread around really quickly through Black Friday. And then uh, Black Friday became even darker than it already is. Yeah, and so basically everything spread and bad stuff happened. There's a lot of people in my safe house. I think I'm gonna have to shoot them. Fantastic work, Agent. Well, back on this place just when it was about to boil over. Well, everybody in here is an agent, and we're all, you know, assigned to go help with the outbreak as best as we can. And uh, that's a pretty generic looking dude right there. Yeah, right now we're just doing side quests until we get on to the real main quest. So let's talk to the gear vendor here, see if he has anything to offer. Um... So yeah, you can see right here it says like 873 DPS damage per second, and then we have a 1207 and a 910, and it tells you if it's better or worse than what you already have. So uh, you can change whether you want to sell or buy weapons. This is a lot of upgrades I can actually be doing right now. And uh, of course you can also pick uh, if you want to do like sidearms or primaries. Like this is a sidearm right here, and... It is more powerful than the one I am using currently. I'm using an 813 sidearm. So I could go ahead and buy this, assuming I want to spend, you know, basically all my money on it. So I don't think I'm going to do it, but M1911s are pretty popular. So I don't know. It could happen. It could happen. So what we need to do here is actually mess around with some of the things here. So I can actually upgrade to this Navy MP5. Um, It's a level 1 versus a level 2, which is weird, but... Oh, that's because this would be like a shotgun. Okay, that's fine. So we'll just stick with this one, and then you can put on a couple mods with it. And yeah. We have a mod here. We could quick release magazine. Okay, we equip that. And that seems to be the only mod we have right now. The only possible one. Armor. We can upgrade to this protective armor right here. That looks pretty good. And... Over here, yep, we got another go bag. Ooh, we got some good protective mask over here. And this only changes the actual physical, um, I guess you wouldn't say physical. It changes the abilities, but doesn't change the physical appearance of your character, if that makes any sense. Well, does that make sense? Yeah. Okay, good. Okay, so like here's the appearance. You can kind of uh, mess around with that. Unfortunately, I don't really have anything. I actually have the hazmat um, day one kind of pack, but I haven't even installed that yet, so I'm not gonna worry about it right now. Hey, check these babies out. Okay, so there's a lot of people in here. Okay. Hmm. 
Was this the right way? No, that was the wrong way. Dang it, wrong way again. So right now in the comment section, you guys, let me know what your favorite game is and why. And also let me know if you're going to be picking up this game and tell me what console you're going to get it on. Because if I need to get this on more than one console to play with some of you guys, that's for sure going to happen. And if you guys do happen to get it on Xbox One, you could actually, uh, you know, hit me up and actually play with my friends. And, you know, bug my friends a little bit. That'd be pretty funny. Make a little trolling video. Where am I going, Jesus? Agent, uh, okay. we just got a distress call from one of the local police precincts we set up as a distribution hub. They're being attacked by rioters. Getting word they're planning on trading hostages for drugs. You need to get in there, eliminate the threat to the precinct, and free any hostages. Agent, get that precinct back under control. If that precinct goes, we lose Brooklyn. Okay, here we go. Somebody's on the roof, yep. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and pick him off here. So eventually, as you keep playing, you'll be getting a lot better upgrades, and everything will start to look better, your character will look better, everything will look better. And then you can be, you know, getting powerful grenades to throw up there, all that good stuff. You know, if I had my friends with me right now, we'd be doing this quest together, so... In a way, if you guys are here from Wizard 101, you guys uh, can actually tell that this is kind of like it in a way, but it's, you know, has guns and it's violent. <laughs> and this actually is one of my favorite kinds of games. Uh, I super duper love playing uh, RPGs, I super duper love playing uh, open world games, those are actually my all time favorite. Got that agent? That's your in. Go get him. I'm trying to shoot in burst to conserve ammo and increase accuracy. But unfortunately, they move so much, it's hard to do that. Also, conserve ammo by going to your secondary which weapon, which has unlimited ammo, and hopefully get headshots. Alert. Additional hostiles inbound. Oh god, that's never good when those guys get next to you. And when you get the guys with bats coming up to you, that's a very bad sign. Or when you're on fire like this. If you guys have ever played paintball, you would know that this is actually kind of like it. Moving up from position to position as you advance on the enemy. It kind of does feel like that. Oh, barely killed that guy before he climbed over that railing. That was so sketchy. Oh my gosh. What I really, really wish for was some to hire somebody to edit my videos for me. Oh my gosh, would that be amazing? I'm working on my personal artist right now, which is pretty awesome. Somebody to like make thumbnails or something like that for me. I'm not quite sure, but you know, if this channel grows and has potential, it's it's something that could definitely happen. Is there somebody up here? Yeah, there was somebody up there. Why can I get him? There we go. Put him down real quick. And if you guys don't know me, well, you better learn now that I ask a lot of questions. I actually ask more questions than answer them in a lot of my videos. It's pretty funny. Like, I like to know what's your guys' favorite smartphone. Like, that's something you also want to ask. I'm always asking stuff to kind of engage the audience. And it's also for my own personal use because I read every single comment, you know. And uh, for the most part, I don't reply to hate. I just reply to, like, the positive ones or somebody asking me a question. Hopefully, I can answer it. You know, that's kind of important, right? <laughs> 
So these guys don't even know I'm here yet, so I can just go ahead and pop a cap in his head. I always want to shoot the guy at the baseball bat first because they're really annoying. They run up to you and start beating you up and then you die and you're like, are you kidding me? That idiot threw a grenade at the roof. Okay, so I do have a grenade, okay. More hostiles inbound. Okay, we got the baseball bat, dude. Yeah, I had to switch to my primary right there to put him down. So always make sure that you keep your uh, primary gun loaded and your secondary gun loaded as much as possible because in the instance where it takes so long to uh, reload, you want to have time to just switch over, which is much faster than reloading. Yeah, it's, it's a very good strategy to know how to do that. So I'll finish up this mission here, and then I'll wrap up the video. And uh, I guess go ahead and edit for an hour before I have to go to work. And gosh, having two jobs, YouTube and school, is one of the hardest things anybody could do. So always make sure that you give uh, YouTubers a lot of credit, because they do go through a lot of stuff, or at least most of them do. And it's only fair to give them credit. I'm not just saying that about me, I'm saying in general, just... Oh god. Like I said right there, switch to that secondary weapon and it could save your day. Keep it down. Don't get them riled up. Play nice and give me time to get us out of here. Well, how am I supposed to do that? Oh, okay. Somehow this guy knows the password to a huge federal computer. That makes sense. Sweep the upper floors. That usually means something bad is gonna happen to me. It means I'm gonna have to kill some guys. So we're moving on to the next situation here. I've waited a long time for Tom Clancy's Vision. Like I watched it when it first was revealed at E3 a couple years ago, and I thought this is gonna be such a cool game. And then they delayed it, and my hype went down a little bit. And then they delayed it again. My hype went down a little bit more until the point where uh, I almost forgot about the game until like you know uh, the first. Uh, closed beta came out and then I played played it then I got more hype for it and then the open beta came out got a little more hype for it and then the official game releases and here I am again and yeah it's 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 not bad it, it, it didn't live up exactly how I expected it to be but um you know I don't know what I was expecting a couple years ago I don't know how much to expect Hoodlums, all they have to do is wear a hat and a hoodie, and you gotta put them down. Profiling pretty hard. Oh shit. Now you know why I hate the guys with the baseball bats. Jeez, get cover. What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh my gosh. He has to be kidding me. He has to be kidding me. This is this is a load of BS. Oh man. All right, Warning. sweep this floor again. Hostiles detected. What I'm gonna do is actually move up to here and try and flank him a little bit. Let's see how that goes. New York ain't the same. Keep looking. Okay. Oh god, no. <laughs> no, 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 no. Baseball dude, back up, bro. Uh, he's already injured me so much.
Oh no, who's who's hurting me now? Warning. Additional incoming hostiles detected. More hostiles? I can't handle anymore. Oh no 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 not the baseball guy. Oh Jesus, these guys are the worst. Oh my god, am I really dead again? Are you serious? Alright, that's a wrap. I'm done.